Hi everyone, thanks for joining us. I'm your host, Heather Dawson, with this weekend's special Valentine's edition of California Life. So are you attracted to someone you work with? A new survey found 40% of employees reported being involved romantically with someone at some point in their careers. However, people still prefer to meet someone through a family or friend. And here's a shocker. 44% of the people surveyed said they would date their friends' former partners. Well, if you're kissing more than two people within a two-week period, a new study shows intimate kissing can quadruple the risk of meningitis, especially for teenagers. And are you looking for love in all the wrong places? Well, you might want to head south. A new survey rates the top 10 best and worst dating cities for singles in the country. Here in California, Los Angeles came in second behind Atlanta as a hot spot for singles. San Francisco also made the top 10 as well as Houston, Detroit, Dallas, Orlando, Philadelphia, Denver, and Boston. As for the worst places to find a date, well, Washington, D.C. took top honors. Rounding out the top five, our very own state capital, Sacramento, Minneapolis, Phoenix, Miami, and Tampa. Well, this Valentine's Day, say I love you with a tweet. Twitter has a specially themed gifts with slogans for your loved one. You can send such messages as tweet me attached with heart-shaped candies. And we all know roses cost a pretty penny around Valentine's Day, so how about a more enduring gift this year? Friends of Guadalupe River Park and Gardens in San Jose are offering adoption that includes an engraved plaque placed in front of the rose of your choice for one year. They might even find a rose to match your Valentine's name. Well, you can always use technology to find the love of your life. In honor of Valentine's Day, we sent our Suzanne Freeman on a tough assignment. As you'll see in her report, using some old ideas and trying the newest technology, California is the hotbed of meeting your perfect partner. Couples are paired for a few minutes each, and when time's up, they move on to the next potential partner. The next step is up to you when you'll decide at the end of the event who you'd like to get to know better. If your crush feels the same way, it's happily ever after. Haven't found your perfect match yet? Try a singles event like the one held at Compartes, holding chocolate decadence dinners for Valentine's Day. Our chocolate decadence dinners are going to be five to seven courses of homemade chocolate desserts, including chocolate pasta with dessert cream sauce, organic salad with walnuts and cranberries, heart-shaped chocolate molten cakes, and homemade chocolate. We're going to transform Compartes into a romantic wonderland. We'll have roses, rose petals everywhere, nice music, candles. Now if you feel like you need a little more help, the solution may lie in an age-old practice matchmaking. We are old-fashioned matchmakers. Basically what we do, we invite you in, we get to know you, what's important for you for a long-term relationship. If you haven't found a date by now, there's always the old standby. Just head down to the bar and ask someone. For Southern California Life, I'm Suzanne Freeman. Hey, guys, do either of you have a date for Valentine's Day? We can't have a Valentine's show without some gorgeous, tempting lingerie, and who better to show off that than Fredericks of Hollywood? We sent our videographer Patrick McCarthy on this assignment. So hot and hot. So hot and One of the things we want to talk about this Valentine's Day is that you don't have to stick with the regular red and pink. Fredericks of Hollywood this Valentine's Day has tons of bright, beautiful colors. Oh! This is lovely Natasha. She's wearing our ever popular Bonjour Kitty baby doll. Trimmed with lace, it's gorgeous, it's fun, it's playful. She's wearing our smooth sensation bra, which is fantastic for the push-up. Underneath, a little surprise, our Cameron Lace Boy Short. Our next model is the gorgeous Hasmik. She is wearing our Luxe Satin Chemise. This is wonderful because the trend nowadays on the runway has been flowy, loose, gorgeous. She's wearing our Hollywood Extreme Cleavage Bra. It's our best-selling bra. It has convertible straps, so you can do a halter, a racer back, everything with it. And it's smooth and seamless. Here comes Candace. She's our fun, flirty, fearless female. She's wearing our ruffle bralette boy short set. Gorgeous, sexy, fun. On the outside, she's covering it up with a mesh rope. Go ahead and give us a little flirt. Oh. Yay! 
And here comes Layla. This is our red corset. And what's so great is that this time, we actually built the bra into the corset so you can have that extra lift and extra cleavage. It takes about two to three inches off your waistline. It pulls everything in and pushes everything out. What woman doesn't love that? The belt is gorgeous. It just came in. We're gonna have a lot of these fashions coming up for spring, but this is so cute for Valentine's Day. This is the ultimate gift. It's our hearts satin pajama set. So cute, so adorable. And she's wearing the smooth sensation bra underneath as well. Happy Valentine's Day from Frederick's of Hollywood. Well, Valentine's Day is here, and while most people are buying flowers and candy hearts for that certain someone, one Orange County teen is making sure our troops overseas are also remembered. Reporter Whitney Noziska has the story. High school senior Haley Smith of Orange isn't looking at a Valentine from her sweetheart. This card is one in a million. Headed to a rock to sweeten Valentine's Day for the troops. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine. You're doing a great job. Shauna Fleming is the girl behind these heart-themed messages. Since 2004, she's collected a million thank you notes for the armed forces in Iraq through her organization, AmillionThanks.org. Now she wants to gather a million Valentines by February 14th. They would rather get mail thank you cards from complete strangers than they would, you know, get food drops and things like that. In these boxes are 200,000 notes ready to ship. And off those boxes of Valentine's go to the servicemen in Iraq. FedEx has donated that expensive postage. Paul Holton, the founder and president of Operation Give, which got FedEx to donate their services, spent time in Iraq as a serviceman. He knows how much mail like this matters to the troops. That little bit of light, if you will, uh, that from the from the homeland, that we're here for you, we're supporting you, go forward and, and then come home safe. With all the troops overseas, even those without an official Valentine can ask someone to be mine. And if you'd like to send a Valentine or a thank you note to our troops overseas, please go to Shauna's website for more information. And do you believe love will find you? Our next guest has the answers for finding true love. We profile two former Olympians who have found everlasting love right here in California. It's all coming up on our special Valentine's show. Welcome back. Big news from Beverly Hills. Celebrity plastic surgeon Dr. Andrew Orden has discovered an anti-aging breakthrough called Fill and Freeze. And he's giving away one million bottles free. I've spent nearly 30 years looking for an effective instant breakthrough to reduce the appearance of wrinkles that can be applied topically instead of with surgery or invasive medical techniques. And I finally found it with Derm Exclusive's Fill and Freeze. Wow, I'm young again. I don't feel like an old lady. The lines are gone. Oh my God, wow. I can't believe it. It looks really good. It gives you a whole new confidence. It definitely took 10 years off. If I went to a dermatologist here in the city, I would pay three, $400 for this. I know you're wondering what Derm Exclusive can do for you. Well, you don't have to wonder. You can order it right now and try it for yourself absolutely risk-free. And here's how. Call now during this special direct-to-consumer offer and you won't pay $120. Today, you can get your own instant results with Fill and Freeze for only $59. But that's not all. Today, we're taking another $20 off, so now you can get this instant wrinkle-removing miracle for the low price of only $39.95. And as part of our 1 million bottle giveaway, Dr. Orden is including a second $60 bottle of Fill and Freeze free. That's nearly $120 of Fill and Freeze for only $39.95. Dr. Orden will even include his micro-peel resurfacing pads, intensive repair serum, and collagen lift moisturizer, a $200 value, free. Order now and we'll even upgrade your order to express delivery. That's a $15 value, free. Plus, you even get to try it risk-free for 30 days with our money-back guarantee. But you must call to order. Call 1-800-619-1871. That's 1-800-619-1871. Order now.
In honor of Valentine's Day, our next guest is a well-known love, dating, and heartbreak expert whose first book, Love Will Find You, has just been released. Catherine Alice has appeared in Psychology Today, Cosmopolitan, The New York Times, and was a guest on Montel. She is in the middle of a book tour and was a keynote speaker at last week's Conscious Life Expo. Catherine, thank you so much for joining us today. Well, thank you, Heather, for having me. And perfect subject for Valentine's <laughs> yes. Day. That's why we booked it. And I love the name of your book. It kind of gives right. hope. I mean, how did you find out? Um, well, I have found that when working with people, love is a big issue, especially Valentine's Day. And I think that when you're looking too hard, it sort of pushes it away. And hmm. so we named the book Love Will Find You because I believe that when you have the right energy, you attract love. You can attract it rather than have to go try to find it. Any age, any time in your life? Exactly. People think that, well, if I'm over a certain age, I can't have love. Or maybe if I lose 50 pounds, I'll get love. You know, different things. And, and I've never found any of that to keep love away from anybody. It is hard to sit back and just wait. I mean, what do you suggest people do that, that really want to find their soulmate? Well, I don't think you have to wait. But I think it's more important what you're doing inside and your energy than anything you do on the outer. And so I think one is to start having the belief that you get love because this is the truth. And I find just lifting up the despair that maybe I'm left out of love, I'll never have it, changes your energy and it really attracts love. So that's number one. And, and I have to say today can kind of be depressing for people. I mean, yeah. if you are alone and you think, gosh, it's never gonna happen for me. Do you have any suggestions for people kind of sitting at home and? Yes, well, first off, don't make a date just to have a date because you're gonna be disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, and secondly, go buy a Valentine's card for the love you don't have yet. I actually did that oh. with my husband. Before, before I ever knew him, I, I bought one, a card that said forever is not long enough with you. And then when I married on, on our wedding day, I gave it to him and it was kind of old by then. But do something like that for the love you don't have yet. Just to give yourself hope and do something loving to somebody else you know who's single, like your aunt or somebody. So, And just don't be alone. Yeah, don't be alone. Yeah. I don't think it's a good time to stay home alone because you'll kind of wallow in your misery if you're, up, you know, if you're upset about it. What about people already in relationships, you know, married couples? I mean, what can they do to kind of keep the love going? I think it's important to not get bored because you can never ever get to the bottom of another person. And mm -hmm. so as you look for the depths and keep trying to get to know them more and keep revealing yourself more, it keeps it alive. And I think you can have crackling chemistry with your soulmate that never dies. Well, I think it's a great message. Love will find you. Everybody wants to believe that. And I'm really looking forward to getting the book as well. So thank you so much, well, Catherine, you. for coming on. And happy Valentine's Day. Up next, what's your favorite romantic moment? We've got the top picks from the big screen and the hottest couples in entertainment. So do you want to do something special for your Valentine? We'll see why Leslie Stowe has caught the attention of Oprah and Martha Stewart as our next guest shows us some Valentine recipes you don't want to miss. It's all coming up right here on our special Valentine's Day episode of California Life. Founded by Jacques Lubin and his partners in 1990, Ink Plan USA has helped thousands of entrepreneurs to form legal entities throughout the world. Our clients have also made productive use of the various services that we offer, initial company registrations, bank consulting, virtual office services, and more. Ink Plan's clientele continues to grow primarily from customer referrals. We are affiliated with Corporate Holding Services, a highly respected Delaware firm that advises large U.S. and international corporations. The Patio Restaurants in San Diego, where you'll always find fresh seasonal food with a distinct local flavor. Toast to the coast at the Patio on Lamont in Pacific Beach. Enjoy beefed up ballpark favorites at the Patio in Left Field at Petco Park. Try the top-notch collection of tequila at the Patio on Goldfinch in Mission Hills. And fire up your taste buds at Fireside by the Patio at Liberty Station. Make your reservation now at thepatiosd.com. I'm former Dallas Cowboy Thomas Hollywood Henderson. I played in three Super Bowls and was at the top of my game until I got addicted to drugs. But today, you can make one call to the Addiction Recovery Network. Addiction has many causes. Call the Addiction Recovery Network and get the right treatment for your unique needs. Your call is totally confidential and completely free. They're available 24 hours a day for you or your loved ones. Call now. Treatment saved my life. 
Are you 65 or older, suffering from back pain, disc herniation, osteoarthritis, or spinal stenosis? Thousands of people are getting the relief they need from the Vertiloc Back Brace from Dr. Approved Medical. Designed with orthopedic technology, the Vertiloc Back Brace can reduce pain and can be an alternative to surgery or medications. Everything may be covered by Medicare or your insurance, so there's little or no cost to you. Call now and get free shipping and our complimentary pain relieving gel. Call 800-379-9684. Doing something special for Valentine's Day doesn't have to cost a fortune. Chef Leslie Stowe has some easy and inexpensive ways to show you care. From creative cards, I've done one here that's the shape of a heart folded over, to a twist on the traditional bouquet of roses. And what I have is a giant martini glass. Leslie Stowe knows how to pump up the Valentine's Day volume without breaking the bank. It's all about the presentation. Leslie is the founder of Leslie Stowe Fine Foods. She has also written a cookbook. Definitely I'm best known for the Raincoast Crisps which are the all-natural seed cracker. They have six different flavors. And they've gotten the seal of approval from both O Magazine and Martha Stewart's Whole Living. Which is really exciting. One way Leslie suggests adding some excitement to your Valentine's Day is with homemade brownies. Brownies are one of my favorite, easiest desserts to make. Start by combining a cup of unsalted butter with eight ounces of Valrhona chocolate. Okay, once your chocolate and butter have totally melted together and you've mixed them so they're totally incorporated, we're then going to cool it off and then mix it into your egg and sugar. Then stir in a cup of unbleached white flour, pour the mixture into a nine inch square baking pan, pop it in the oven for 20 to 25 minutes and voila! So our brownies are done. We've taken them out of the oven and we've let them cool. Now comes the fun part, the presentation. So we're going to take a cookie cutter and we're going to cut the brownie out. And we're just going to put this onto a white plate. And we're going to serve this with a raspberry coulis. What we're going to do here is we're just going to trace the actual brownie. Then dust it with a little icing sugar. How great does that look? It's an easy presentation, looks fantastic, and your guests will be really impressed. Leslie just launched a blog with lots more great recipes and decorating tips. Just visit lesliestow.com. Bringing you the best of Valentine's Day, I'm Audra Stafford for California Life. Well, Valentine's Day is a perfect time to snuggle up and take in a great romantic movie. AOL Video created a highlights reel of the top five most romantic movie moments that can be seen online. And topping the list was a scene from Jerry Maguire when Jerry tells Dorothy, you complete me. And top 10 hottest couples according to LovingYou.com starting with number 10. Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie top out at number one. Well, in honor of the Olympics, our very own Brent Weber catches up with an Olympic couple living right here in California. It was 1976, the Summer Games of Montreal, the first since Munich. The last chance, perhaps, for Bill Leach, his younger bride, Fellow Olympic kayaker Julie at 19 figured it might come again, but the Olympic boycott of 80 would follow, so this would be their only Olympiad. You know, it seems like it was yesterday, and it's 30 years ago. It's just stunning to think about that. And uh, yeah, it was the highlight of our, well, certainly my career as an athlete. <laughs> it seemed like a very long time ago, seems like 30 years. It's a different lifetime. I was much younger. 
and you know I have kids and um, a teaching job so actually it does seem like ancient history. That they experienced it together was historic. Bill and Julie you see didn't meet at the Olympics. There were three couples that year. One was a coach and, and an athlete and the others were um, runners on the track team but they qualified after we did so officially we are the first married couple to gone to the Olympic Games uh, that didn't meet at the Olympics or something. So now that's pretty common, actually. You don't get to stay together as a, a married couple, so that's a little bit difficult. Now they look back, winter, summer, the games matter not. They still stir something inside. I don't, I'm not too excited about it, and then I start watching it, and I'm, en I'm enthralled because I know what the energy level's like. still get the goosebumps when you think about it, and you still get the sort of the emotional feeling as you watch the opening ceremonies. And all in all, there are several dozen Olympians, winter and summer, who live in Southern California, but don't call them former Olympians. As Leach says, once an Olympian, always an Olympian. Brent Weber, Southern California Life. It's tax time, and the question as you fill out your income taxes, are you keeping as much money in your pocket as possible? A new United Way survey shows that a number of working Americans making $62,000 or less don't realize the tax credits they've earned. And the survey also found that most were unaware they qualify for free tax preparation services. About 72% of those working Americans actually didn't know that they qualify for free tax preparation services. And about a third of them were actually paying for services from a tax expert when they actually qualified for free services. And so that's why we sponsor something called My Free Taxes. Through a generous grant from the Walmart Foundation and online software provided by H&R Block, we provide a platform, MyFreeTaxes.com, that allows working families to access free tax preparation services, so filing their state and federal taxes online in a free, safe, and easy way, but also identifying uh, which tax credits they may actually qualify for so that families can get money back in their tax returns. And as the United Way survey shows, most Americans aren't sure what tax credits they're eligible for. Things like the Earned Income Tax Credit or the Child Tax Credit. Again, these are tax credits that many working Americans have already earned. If they don't make sure that they submit their taxes and take advantage of those credits, they may not get those monies back. Hundreds of dollars, sometimes thousands of dollars that they are leaving behind when that money could actually come back to those families and they could use those monies for immediate needs. And the software on MyFreeTaxes.com is meant to help tax filers easily navigate the process with helpful prompts and even help on the phone or in person. There's information available in English and Spanish, so if you're not quite sure what the process needs to look like, the information is there and it walks you through the process in a very easy way. The other thing is that on MyFreeTaxes.com, if you're more comfortable filing your taxes in person, there's also information about what we call volunteer income tax assistance sites so that you can go to a center and actually get some free tax preparation help in person. And that free tax preparation help is part of the United Way's overall effort to improve life for all Americans. Well, United Way is the largest nonprofit organization in the country, and our focus is making sure that every American has an opportunity to live a better life. And there are really three areas that really we focus on. One is education, making sure that kids and young people and adults have access to quality education. We want to make sure that families can be financially secure. And during tax season, there's no better time than to focus on how to make sure that you can preserve the money that you've worked so hard to earn. And we also want to make sure that families have access to a great healthy lifestyle. And so those are the things that United Ways all around the country, over 1,100 United Ways and dozens of them in California, that's what we focus on. And we want to make sure that MyFreeTaxes.com is available to people so that they have easy, safe, free access to that information, can easily file their taxes, find out what credits they do qualify for, and uh, get any questions answered that they have. So as you get ready for tax season, make sure to take advantage of all the United Way has to offer at MyFreeTaxes.com. Bringing you the best of California, I'm David Wiley for California Life. And that's it for us. Thank you so much for joining us for our Valentine's special. And you can also see us online at CaliforniaLifeHD.com. We'll see you next time.